Buenos dias and welcome back to my channel everybody. Today we are talking about five accessories you cannot live without on your Canon EOS R. In fact, it can be any camera that you own. I do want to mention that every product that you're going to see here today on this video I paid for by myself and in no way shape or form are they sponsoring this video. In fact, you can find all the links to every one of these products down below so you can take a closer look. All right, let's get into the video. The first item you see here is the Peak Design Camera Clip. I absolutely love this thing. I love traveling with this thing. I love going out and shooting with this thing. This thing is very versatile. This thing is a camera clip. You can secure it to the strap of your backpack. You can secure it to a belt. You can secure it to a bag. It is very versatile. It is very strong. It comes in two different colors, in silver and I believe matte black. I have the silver as you can see here. It's a very simple design, but very unique. So how you utilize this product is you take this base plate and you put it on the bottom of your camera like so. The only thing that I don't like about this design, it comes with an Allen wrench type tightening screw. So you gotta have this tool in order to actually affix it. But once you do affix it, it is super hard to get off. And I think that's the idea. When you have thousands of dollars hanging off of a little clip, you definitely want it to be strong and tight. I have seen some hacks where this bolt is actually removed and what is affixed and added is a loop style bolt that you can actually turn in a fix and hand tight. So this isn't a bad idea. I haven't done it yet. I'm not sure I will. I love that this is not coming off. Sometimes it's a pain in the butt because you don't have this tool with you, but I'll live with it. This camera is going nowhere once this clip is affixed to a backpack or like I said, to a belt or a bag. And then you simply just slide it on and it is just tight. It's got a quick release button right here. And when it is on the backpack, I usually have it right here on my backpack. My thumb fits right into the base. You can actually push on that button to release the camera. So if I need to get that shot, I just remove it and I'm off to the races. Oh yeah. The next item I cannot live without are these little anchors that you see on my camera. They're always in my images and my thumbnails, but these anchors, I just love them. They're so versatile. They just sit on my camera and I can exchange different camera straps that have the anchors. They just slip right in there and they're ready to go. They're quick release. You can pull them off real quick. And when I'm doing video, this is a nice way to keep three points of contact. One on the back, and then my hand here, my hand here, you're pushing out and you're getting nice movement up and down diagonally. I can't say enough about these anchors and the anchor loops. You can actually purchase the anchor loops and the anchors separately so that you can attach these anchor loops on another type of strap. These anchors are really well made and once they do start to wear, they have a system by which they start showing different colors of threads and those threads are letting you know that you're getting deeper and deeper into maybe changing them out. I've had these for about a year and a half. I transferred them from another camera onto the Canon EOS R and I just love them. Woo! Another must have for me on the Canon EOS R, both for photo and for video, was to have an ND filter. And this ND filter is by Polar Pro. It is the Peter McKinnon model. It is a little bit more pricey than the average ND filter, but it does come with quality glass. I've always subscribed to the notion of why you would put cheap glass or plastic on your thousand dollar lens. I still think that, that's why I'm not putting cheap glass on my lens. I'm actually using a very well-made product, a piece of glass that very much complements all my glass on the Canon EOS R. So when I'm out shooting photos and videos, I love that I have the ability to control light with just the spin of a dial from two to five stops. So this has been key. I love this tool. There are many other brands out there. You should try an ND filter if you do not have one. It's something you might feel you do not need until you try it. And as far as photography and video go, this thing has been indispensable. Love the Polar Pro Peter McKinnon 82 millimeter two to five stop ND filter. This is the one. Love this thing. 
All right, the next thing on the list is a powder brush. I mean, this thing puts on the makeup just swell. Hey, hey, come on now. So this is the Rode Video Micro. And why this is such a big hit out in YouTube land and people that are running and gunning video, because it is very simple to use. You plug it straight into the mic jack here. This, this plugs in right into the video micro there. And once you turn on your camera, it is on. There's no worrying about whether you're capturing audio or not. It does a really good job of filtering out the noise that you don't want to hear. The reality is when you're a one man crew and you're trying to film yourself and you want good quality audio, this is a great low profile solution. It just works. This is my number one go to when I'm out running and gunning. It's just, isn't it pretty too? Come on, come on. Hey, it kind of matches my beard. Okay. And finally, the fifth thing that I recommend and something I cannot live without on my Canon EOS R, which I've had for over a year, is a hot shoe cover. I don't have one with me. In fact, I just ordered one. The reason I just ordered one is because when there is not something covering the hot shoe, then it is susceptible to dust, to corrosion, to abrupt contact, which could cause bending of all of the contact points here. You don't want that. You definitely wanna get out there and use this tool. Get in adverse weather conditions, rain, sleet, snow. Yes, get out there. That's where you get those rad shots. That's right, I said rad. I'm from the 80s, totally rad. That's what we say back in the day. And so that is something that I just ordered because I can't believe that I live by the ocean. I take it out there all the time. I can't believe that I'm leaving it susceptible to salt water, getting into contact with those points and essentially having to replace that piece. Why not cover it with a hot shoe cover? Take care of that and have peace of mind that you can get out there and really make this weather sealed. All right, that's gonna do it. That's five things I cannot live without on the Canon EOS R. If you do not have the Canon EOS R, no worries. All of these things are applicable to you and your camera as well. That's gonna do it. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Please leave me a message down below. I'd love to hear from you. Like this video if you liked any part of it. Please ring that bell so you're notified of new videos. I love you guys. Peace. Oh.